Welcome to a very special edition of Inspire Pro TV. This episode dedicated to the career of the ever so unique Chris Wolf as she celebrates her retirement from professional wrestling. Later tonight, we show you what happened in the closing moments of the No Mercy 64 gauntlet match from back in March. But right now, we travel into the vault to see Chris's debut for Inspire Pro back in July of last year at Battle Dreams, when she took on undefinable champion Delilah Doom in singles action. You know, this crowd is going to be split pretty much right down the middle. Absolutely. And Delilah Doom got her first look at the championship, but what could it mean if, if Chris Will picks up the win in this matchup? Delilah could have been undefinable champion without ever putting the belt around her waist. So the fun and games is great, but wait. Oh. <laughs> Chris Wolf does love herself some beef jerky. This is I thought David Letterman only had the, the Super Pet tricks. Oh, she shakes! It's good. It's a good start. Chris will very well train, train not just in Japan, right. but elsewhere. Chris Wolf getting some ta a taste of that delicious meat that she craves. Oh, wait. <laughs> Uh-oh. Wait, I think Chris, Chris Wolf just said some delicious meat! He made it down! We're underway with this contest. That has got to be one of the most unique ways to start a wrestling match I've seen in my four decades. Shoulder tackle, oh, dude. Innovative way to get in the ring there is now the hold of Chris Wolf. Oh, but Chris Wolf having none of it. Nothing pretty about that, just dropped her. And now Delilah takes down Chris with the arm drag. Next to clothesline, Chris Wolf flows through. But heads is a doom down into the turnbuckle. Double drop kick. Nice little back and forth between these two here in the uh, opening rounds. Looks like they've kept a pretty similar style. Absolutely very similar style in that ring. I think the biggest difference though between the two has to be uh, uh, the training. Uh, Chris Wolf tra training in some of the greatest Japanese dojos for the start and promotion. You know, Chris Wolf has lived pre professional wrestling. You know, Moving to Japan to really hone her craft, and Delilah Doom, I think, hopes to one day reach that level that Chris Wolf is right now in the in the independent wrestling scene. Well, and Delilah Doom's quickly getting there. You know, she has made waves all across the country uh, with her appearances, holding tag team titles with the likes of Leva Bates. So. Chris Wolf tries for the kiss. Oh, and a shot right to the gut by Chris Wolf. <laughs> And it's amazing because Chris Wolf, she made her debut in August of 2014. So she's been wrestling less than four years. Not as much long as Doom has now that I think about it. Doom now comes charging. Ooh, sidestep. Doom rolls out of the way, and Chris Wolf goes head first into the buckle. Doom, look at that! Nice takeover by Doom. Looking to stay on top of Chris Wolf here now. Doom, as you mentioned, you know, not that young, naive little girl that first walked through the doors over four years ago here in Inspire for Wrestling. She's become one badass little competitor. Springs up to the top. Cross body. Oh, Chris Wolf throws through. Double stop. Right in the gut of Delilah Doom. And now just stomping right in the back of the head of Doom. Chris Wolf can be very vicious. We're seeing an example of that right here. 
And think what it would mean for Chris. Wait a minute. Oh, oh yes, he's spelling her! Yeah, Hazard and Kamba modified him to clutch there. And then stuffs the tail down the gullet of Delilah Doom. You know, Chris Wolf would probably, ooh, stomp right to the back of the neck. Quite the, uh, as I said, eccentric competitor, but very serious in that ring, can really, ooh, hit you and kick you and, and really beat you down. Ooh, and there's a kick right to the chest. You heard Richard Whitaker, you know, referred to as the box smasher. She has earned that name. Oh! There's the reason why. <laughs> her, prize, her prize wolf, Tito. <laughs> and, and now we've got the... <laughs> Did Lance Hoyt just enter the ring or something? Chris... Lance Hoyt, you know, going for the, the spray of the water, getting kind of put to shame here by Chris Wolf. What is it? What is it? <laughs> it's now Delilah Wolf. Oh, wait. Chris Wolf going to come charging. Oh, right into the lower extremities again. Again. And now Chris Roller in the center of the ring in for a cover. Hook your leg. I think what it could mean if Chris Wolf were to capture the undefinable championship here. Obviously, more appearances here in Inspire Pro Wrestling. That's true. Ooh, Delilah with a slap. But at the same time, like, like y'all were saying, you know, Delilah Doom losing the championship without ever even holding the belt. Ooh, sending the buckle, and Doom comes in with a forearm, rolls through. Another one. Oh, and a shoulder tackle in the corner. Doom is a house of fire here. Doom's got to keep up that momentum. Ooh, aerobics in the corner with those knees. Oh, and there's that running knee in the corner, connecting square against the face of Chris Wolf. Now can Doom pull Wolf in the center and get a cover here? Able to muscle the shoulder up is Chris Wolf. It's going to take a lot more than that for Doom to put her away. I believe so. Yeah, Doom's got to keep up that momentum. Keep up the attack on Chris Wolf. Doom reeling a bit in the corner, comes charging. Sidestep by Chris Wolf. Oh, there's that nice jumping knee. Comes charging again. Springs up. Oh, and knees are again. Yeah, double knees right to the chest. Looking for the cover, hook of the leg. Chris Wolf. I think. I don't know how much she's scouted necessarily at Delilah Doom before this contest, but she's slowly starting to feel what Delilah Doom's position out. And I think that, I think vice versa is true as well. Ooh. Crowd firmly divided between the two. I mean, this match has been as even as you can imagine. Doom lures Wolf in and drop toll hole turn to the second row. Now what you got in mind. Oh, tries for that Tiger Fink kick. And Chris Wolf with the drop kick sends Doom right out onto the floor. Hang on, though. Uh-oh. Chris Wolf going to the air. That's a long way up. Oh, my God. You know, didn't know Wolves could fly until tonight. Chris Wolf flying. From the that top was... turnbuckle out onto the floor here of the AFS Cinema. Both women outside the ring. They got to get this action back in the ring. And now, it's like Wolf wants to go into the crowd. She's got to stay on top of Doom here. She's looking for something. I think she's a little lost here trying to. Oh, Doom just taking her out right onto the floor there. Kind of just fell on her, but, you know, it worked. Because now Doom's down. Wolf is down. You know, we got to stay hydrated out here, so. 
Doom laid out here on the floor. I think she yeah. made it. It looked like she was grabbing an ankle. I couldn't tell for sure. Either her ankle or her knee. But Doom is definitely in worse for her, and Chris Wolf trying to stay on top of her. <laughs> Chris Wolf just got him paraphernalia from our fans here. Ooh, Delilah with a forearm. And yet Doom is definitely limping on that leg. Rolling back into the ring. Oh, no, but Doom just trying to break the count. And now, yeah, Doom just... Ooh, just sending Chris Wolf hard into the into the steps there and and But yeah that, that limp on Delilah Doom very evident. Now sitting Wolf down in a chair. What does she got in mind here? Uh-oh. Whenever someone sets up chairs, it's never gonna end well. What's Doom thinking? Oh! Oh my God, Wolf just sidestepped and Delilah just ended up crashing those chairs. And now look, Wolf. Wolf now up onto the apron. Oh my God. Rolling combo kick. But again, they got to get it back in the ring to, to attempt a pin. Yeah, a lot of damage being done right now outside and not only each other, the chairs as well, but. But those may have been some drastic mistakes by Delilah Doom. First, that miscalculation that made, had her tweak her ankle, and then just going head first into those chairs. This could cost Doom the championship here if Chris Wolf can take advantage. Doom able to get his shoulder up. I gotta be honest, I'm a little surprised. Doom has taken a lot of punishment. I'm a little surprised that she was able to kick out there too. Wolf ooh, tries for a kick. Roundhouse missed again. Block. And Chris Wolf gets that shot in. Right across the chest. Again with the kick out. That angle of doom cannot be doing her well in this contest. Yeah, you can see her grabbing her left ankle there for a moment. Oh, doom just trying her best to get up to her feet and is able to Take Chris Wolf off her balance. And now, what is Doom doing? Trying to climb up on one good leg. Not she, a, she, oh. Wolf sends Doom down hard into the mat. Go oh, double knees! That's gotta be a cover! Doom, reversal! And now, and now Doom, trying for a submission hold here. Looks like got, She's got her in a straight jacket! Referee's asking. The referee's checking. Is Chris Wolf going to give it up here? Doom out of desperation, putting her in that hold. Thing is, get, yeah, oh. trying to put her to sleep, looks like. That's two. That's, That's it. it! Delilah Doom would emerge from the battle with the one-of-a-kind Chris Wolf victorious. However, she would not fare as well at our most recent event, Shockwaves, as she defended against the current lawless darkness, Cody Lane. With Cody exempt from all rules in Inspire Pro Wrestling, Doom knew she was at a disadvantage. But she and many others couldn't believe how far Cody would take things to become champion. <laughs>
So allow me to reintroduce myself. I'm Young Kodak, OOF! Your lawless darkness champion, and now your new undefinable champion. Delilah Doom, you may not think what I did was right. Ethan Price, you may not think what I did was right. But shit, it felt right to me. OOF. Inspire Pro Wrestling presents A Hero Never Dies 2 on Sunday, May 26th, our final event in the AFS Cinema in Austin, Texas. Already announced, MJF defends his Pure Prestige Championship against Terrell Tempo, with the added stipulation that if Tempo does not leave with the Pure Prestige title, he must leave Texas and Inspire Pro Wrestling. Plus, don't miss the Inspire Pro Wrestling debut of Santana and Ortiz, the Latin American Exchange, they challenge Cherry Ramones and Thunder Rosa, Juicy Thunder, for the Twin Dragon Connection Championship. Tickets are on sale now at InspireProWrestling.com. Get yours today and be there May 26th to experience the history and the fury. As we continue to celebrate Chris Wolf's time in Inspire Pro Wrestling, we now take you to our feature matchup of the week from our Shockwaves event in March. Competitors of all kinds, both male and female, battled it out in the No Mercy 64 gauntlet match with an opportunity to challenge for the Inspire Pro Championship at stake.
occurring left and right, the field narrowed down to the point that only female competitors remained, ensuring that one of these women would make Inspire Pro history in being the first woman to challenge for Inspire Pro's longest standing title, the Inspire Pro Championship. We take you now to the closing moments of the No Mercy 64 Gauntlet match featuring its final four competitors. Chris Wolf entering the contest as the final entry in a field that includes Jenna Lynn, Shotzi Blackheart, and Penelope Ford. Check it out. And now, Chris Wolf here comes out. Oh, but <laughs> big, I think it was a headbutt there by Chris Wolf, just takes down Jenna Lynn. Chris Wolf, so hard of a competitor to predict. Well, when you, when you have when you have no set strategy. Oh, oh wait, always he's got the brisket. On. I mean, she does love her delicious meats. Oh, Penelope. <laughs> they're play uh oh, they lost the brisket. I mean, they're just taunting Chris Wolf here. We know she loves delicious meat. We know she craves it. And I'll just train uh, with Penelope. For this I mean, is just mean. What better? What better? What, what better? You know, meat than Texas brisket? Chris Wolf. <laughs> don't tease her like this. I don't like when people do it to dogs. I don't like when people do it to Chris Wolf. You see. Oh! <laughs> Chris well, Wolf. She got her meat. And she, she's just sharing. She's sharing. Sharing is caring, and right? Snap suplex rolls through here by Chris Wolf on Penelope Ford. One of these four women is going to get a shot at the Inspire Pro Championship cover. And Penelope Ford. Penelope Ford has been eliminated. And that's what you get for teasing a wolf. That's right. I mean, she got a bit of a souvenir, I guess, but. Yeah, you know, consolation prize, a little bit of brisket. And now. Keep an eye on Shotzi. A little roll through. Shotzi very versed at being able to think on her feet. Oh, wait. Sido suplex. Shotzi looking to take advantage on Chris Wolf here. Ooh, big rolling forearm. We, we know Chris Wolf is is Ooh. nearing the end of her career, and what a way, what better way to go out than to be a contender for the Inspire Pro Championship. Shotzi Blackheart not giving up here after that bulldog. She's got to find something else in her playbook, trying to bring Chris Wolf up onto her shoulders. Chris able to fight free, sunset flip roll through. Shotzi able to get his shoulder up at two. Chris Wolf definitely the freshest in this contest. So Ooh, double know, knees. You know that's got to be a huge advantage for Chris Wolf. Comes charging. Shotzi trying to block. Ooh, what a kick there by the bare feet of Chris Wolf. Ooh, innovative German suplex. Both these, both these ladies have traveled the world over. Battling in rings. Double knees again oh, to the vicious. gun of Shotzi Blackheart. And Shotzi, Shotzi Blackheart. Blackheart has been eliminated. And we're, we're down to final two, aren't we? We're down to two. And what a contrast here in Chris Wolf and Jenna Lynn. Contrast in styles, contrast in experience. This is... But if you're Jenna Lynn, you live for something like this. Ooh, Jenna. Nice athleticism here. Telling Chris Wolf to bring it. Shots. Repeated kicks. There's that karate background coming into play. Jenna Lynn, no fear here. A huge kick there by Jenna. And Chris Wolf able to get the shoulder up. Don't let Jenna Lynn's small size fool you. But I will say, if this is a, if this is a, she has to beat to get an Inspire Pro Championship shot, this may be her toughest test to date in Chris Wolf. Ooh, big boot. Easily, easily. And now Wolf backing Jenna into the corner. Wait a minute. Jenna Lynn becoming a wolf. And it's repeated. Shoulder blocks into the gut. Oh, wait a minute. This can't be good here for Jenna Lynn. Oh, 
Oh my God! That, we'll mean, we'll let that speak for itself. Chris Wolf, that unique offense now. Oh, and the catch is going away immediately. She calls herself the box smasher, but. I think Chris Wolf realized she went a little bit too far, but got to take advantage here against Jenna Lynn. She's got Jenna reeling. She definitely does. Oh, what a clothesline, though. Jenna Lynn firing back and follows it with another. Who tries for that kick. Rolls through, strips a leg. Goes for a boot. Jenna blocks. Ducks the kick. Sweeps the leg. Goes for a kick again. Repeated shots. And for a cover. Only two is Chris Wolf able to get the shoulder up. But that's got to be huge credit. Jenna Lynn getting a near fall there on Chris Wolf. Ooh, big jawbreaker. Chris Wolf. It's got Jenna, real, Jenna Lynn rocking. Jenna able to block. Sidestep. Went for the kick again. Chris Wolf catches her. Plants her with that innovative back suplex. No! Jenna Lynn able to get the shoulder up. That undying spirit, that never say die effort of Jenna Lynn. And you know, Chris Wolf has got to be thinking, what do I have to do to put this woman away? I think Jenna Lynn may be starting to realize she's a little bit outmatched here with somebody with the caliber of Chris Wolf. Forearm shots again, repeated blows. Jenna Lynn, with all the punishment that's been dissed out to her in this contest, definitely worse for wear. As to Both women just trying their best here to get some breath in them, I think. The stamina in this contest is always super important. Oh, Jenna, able to block. And we'll block again, going her weight down. And now send Chris Wolf into the corner. Comes charging. Sends her out onto the apron. Very spirited contest here. A huge kick to the gut by Jenna, Jenna Lynn. Roll through. It's got her up. Plants her with a DDT! She got it! And your winner, and the first ever woman to be number one contender for the Inspire Pro Championship, Jenna Lynn. A series of upsets by Jenna Lynn last event and now beating Chris Wolf in the center of that ring. Congratulations, Jenna, on your win. Thunder Rosa. Thunder Rosa out here. I would like to have Chris Wolf back in the ring, please. The female the locker room emptying out here. See Delilah Chris, Doom, Baby Chris. D, Rachel Rose. Shiva Queen. Well, they just told me that I needed to come and talk about Chris Wolf. And I'm not even saying anything. I'm going to start crying. This is her last match here in Texas. And she's retiring from wrestling. jeans in Japan. When I was there, it was my first year wrestling, and it was her first year too. When I heard her story and how she started wrestling, it really moved my heart. She definitely made my stay in Japan better. I almost died being there, and she was there for me the whole entire time. When I came back, she was again there for me and there for all the girls that weren't to start them. Without her, I don't think our stay would have been the way and as warm as it was for all of us. I just want to thank you for being my friend. No matter how far you are, if you're in Japan, Europe, Australia, I don't know, because you're traveling everywhere, because you're a homeless girl. <laughs> and I love you, and adventurous as you are. 
You deserve everything, and I'm so proud. I'm so proud that the first year that I was there, I opened your eyes and told you to go and get it. And she came to America, and she became a star because they told her that she will never be a star. And look at her today. family, the Cervantes family, we love you and we wish you the best. I hope you are the best carpenter there ever will be. I love you. So one more time. Oh! I can say on behalf of everyone in Inspire Pro Wrestling Management roster, a big thank you to Chris Wolf for bringing her style, bringing her energy here to Austin, Texas, and to inspire for wrestling. As Thunder Rosa said, she has paved the way for many women. She's been one of the standards for women's wrestling, not only in Inspire Pro, but all over the world. It has been such a great pleasure and honor to get to know her and we wish her so much love and success. Whatever she does in the next chapter of her life, as she winds down.